So welcome back to another partner massage. This is Heather Wibbles at MassageByHeather.com. Uh, we've already finished doing the scalp massage. We ended the temple and forehead massage with circles around the temple. So this is where you should be right now. Uh, once you finish doing circles around the temple, we're going to do some work on the jaw. The jaw's main muscle is called the masseter. It's this big muscle right in here. All you're going to do is take your fingers, take the first couple finger pads, and you're going to continue those circles that you started around the temple, and you're just going to run down the side of the jaw on either side at the same time, all the way to the edge of where the jaw is. So I am just going to draw circles down, and then circles back up. You can probably feel the masseter muscle, that jaw muscle. It's usually pretty well defined on people. So again, you're just going to go down and back up. Like this is our second time going down and back up. We'll do one more. Be real careful with the pressure on the jaw. If you're working on someone who has jaw issues, uh, it can be very tender. Once you're finished with the circles the third time, uh, you can just draw some lines straight down to the corner of the jaw. So I'm using medium pressure here, not very deep on Brooks. I've just got the tips of my fingers on the skin right here and I'm just pushing my hands downward. I'm going to ask Brooks to open up his jaw as I move downward. Go ahead and open up your jaw. That's going to stretch it out just a little bit. I'm going to have him do that for me about four times, so three more times. And again you're going to go slow here moderate to light pressure depending on what the person you're working on prefers. Last time, there you go. Alright, so once you've done these circles and the lines, we're going to go back to the circles for just a minute. The last thing we're going to do is a sweep across the cheekbones. So I'm going to turn his head a little bit towards you so you can see what I'm going to do. I'm going to put my finger pads of both hands right underneath the cheekbones. You can see that here. I'm basically going to sweep outward towards kind of between the ear and the bottom of the jaw. So I'm just going to sweep down the line of the cheekbones. So we'll do that about three times. And then we'll finish up on the face. That's going to be the last bit of the work we do on the face. I want to put both palms, wrap them around the, the jaw right here. Use the full surface of my palm to kind of stick to his face and just pull upward, sweep upward. As I get towards the top, I'm gonna to put my thumbs together and then sweep down the back of, or the top of the head. So I'll do that again. Uh, surface of the palm around the chins, sweep upwards. I'm not using a lot of pressure here. I'm pulling down the top of the skull. I usually do this about three times. This will finish up the work on the face. Last up, we have work on the ear. Join me back here tomorrow or at the next video for the work around the ear. This is Heather Wibbles at MassageByHeather.com.